What's up everyone? So today we're going to be grabbing probably one of the coolest tools that I've seen in a while. I've never heard of this thing. We're going to check it out today. Now, if you guys aren't familiar with the channel, this is a vlog channel. It's about life and being a little bit of fun. If you're new to that, I hope you enjoy it. If you guys are returning, appreciate your support. Thank you very much and I hope you enjoy as well. I've always sucked at this whole cardio thing. We gotta run out right now. Uh, we're gonna go and do some running around. There's some stuff that we had shipped in that now we're returning. It's a big mess getting that out of the way. Uh, doing some stuff to clean up the house just a little bit. And we're gonna run and get that tool. Since we're gonna be running around, I figure I might as well pack the backpack. Okay, so basically what's going on is we're still doing all the data lines, these guys. So because of all the stuff we're doing with the uh, data, I had to send Alana to go and get a bunch of uh, well, straps just to kind of like uh, hold it in place. And I miscalculated. So now we got to run these guys back since we're already going to Home Depot. <laughs> oh no, my truck hasn't been moving very much since uh, my 4x4. Isn't it insane that it can literally go from like a full blizzard in the morning to this in Canada? <laughs> wow. Okay, package is acquired. Let me just tell you guys one thing. This is a beefy boy, a very beefy boy. Now this tool and many others like it are really awesome for one really good reason. They're really cheap and they completely replace you having to get another device, or I suppose we could call them right angle drills, drivers, impacts. And instead, you can get this. This thing feels really nice actually. Very, very smooth. Doesn't have a lot of wiggle right here. Very, very minimal. Materials all feel really, really nice. To be honest, went into this with very low expectation happily surprised. So this Milwaukee tool is rated for approximately 230 inch pounds. It's pretty sweet actually. They give you this little handle here that you can actually use to get a little bit more leverage. But at the same time, when you completely unloosen it, loosen it, you can raise it all the way up here. Now you can actually spin this thing as much as you want or as much as you need. Okay, let's see how it works. <laughs> this thing's beefy. <laughs> Ooh, that was a learning experience. This guy is the top of the line Milwaukee right angle bit adapter. This guy has the best build quality. Milwaukee in general has the best build quality for these kind of adapters. With that being said, I have some of the other ones here. This is going to be the first one that you're going to see. This is the first one that Milwaukee did. You can see a little bit of uh, inspiration coming over into this one. This one is crap. No one likes it. They'll use it, but they would definitely much rather have this new one. This seemed to be the first gen. And then after this one, they came out with this guy here. And it's actually a pretty nice unit. This is the one that I originally was trying to buy because I thought this was the newest. It looks the newest. However, just know that this one can only handle half the torque that this guy can. So you're kind of selling yourself short. The bits do sit in quite a bit deeper, but I mean, if this doesn't fit, should you really be screwing it there? <laughs> when I was using this guy, the handle I originally said I was going to have out 
just a little bit to give me kind of that extra grip. I was doing that for a while and then I found it was easier to use it down. So watch this. It always, okay, I got lucky that time. 60% of the time it works every time. That doesn't make sense. It always weighs down. When you take this guy and bring him as close to the shaft as you can. That's what she said. You can see that this guy is actually willing to stay put. My recommendation, keep this guy in if you can help it. So is this guy a worthy investment? Yes. At some point, you're going to need it and you're going to wish you had it and then you're going to go and buy it. I hope this video helped you guys decide if you're going to get one or not. If you guys enjoyed the video, stay safe out there and have a good one. My God, you'll never guess what I just figured out. I have a normal standard bit right here. If I go like this, that's a special tip for the guys that stay around to the end. Appreciate you. <laughs>